Look at a moving train, hundreds of tons of steel running on two narrow lines, yet everything stays perfectly stable. The secret is not power, it is the almost invisible shape of the wheels. A train wheel is not a cylinder, it is a cone. Its running surface has a subtle slope, wider on the outside, narrower on the inside. This shape allows the train to guide itself. Each pair of wheels is fixed on the same axle, and when the train drifts even a single centimeter to one side, the outer wheel rolls on a larger effective diameter. The inner wheel rolls on a smaller one. In one rotation, the outer wheel travels farther, and that difference brings the whole system back to the center. It is passive self-guidance, driven only by geometry and weight. In curves, the same principle compensates for the difference in length between the two rails. The conical profile, often around 1 to 20, keeps the train stable without extra mechanisms, and the small vertical flange on the inside of the wheel does not steer the train. It is only a last resort guardian, active only in extreme situations. The solution is so simple that it feels like magic, but it is not magic. It is pure physics, refined in metal. Sometimes the path stays safe simply because the shape is right. 